Right about now, we have our final interview for the day. We're actually talking right now with Queen Elizabeth Okoye. Now, she's an actor, musician, and content creator. Her role as Somkele in the latest blockbuster, Roberta, produced by ace actor producer Stefanora Okere, is one to watch. Hi, welcome. Hi. Welcome to Nigeria. Thank so you. So the pronunciation is Somkele. Yes. Somkele. Yes. Amazing. So tell me about yourself. Before we get into Roberta, which yes. is what we'll talk about today, yes. tell me about yourself. I mean, you seem very artistic. Uh -huh. So you're a makeup artist, yes. you're a singer, you're an actor. <laughs> so tell me, so when did you discover this creative side of yours? Um, I think it's something that I've always just had. You know, growing up, I'm quite very versatile with a lot of things. I like, you know, putting my hands in anything that's possible that I can yeah. put my hands on. Yeah. So I think that's literally, you know, how it all started. Um, I had so many dreams, you know, a lot of things I wanted to be, yeah. you know, growing up. But I mean, I'm in a good place right now, as you can, like literally in a good place yeah. right now. So, but it's been amazing anyways, mm -hmm. at the end of the day. Yeah. It's been amazing, you know, combining um, acting, music, makeup artists and all of that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think in general, I can just say it's been fun. It's been fun. Yes. All yes. right. Amazing. So tell me, so which predicated which, makeup artist or singing? Um, which what? Predicator, which came first? Um, singing, actually. Singing? So everyone in my house sings. Yeah. I come everyone from, in your house. Yes. Oh, nice. My dad is a singer. I've got four brothers and okay. two big sisters. I'm the last. Oh. And everyone in my house sings. Everybody, so okay. Music has always just run, you know, mm. it's still running in the family. So mm. everyone sings and it's something that like we do. Like sings professionally? Yes. Ooh, something wow. We do. Yes, yes. Oh, something amazing. We do do you guys fun. have like a family record or something? Yes, actually we do. Oh. My, my dad still writes, you know. Oh. Amazing. You know, we kind of come together, mm. probably Christmas, around Christmas period, yeah. we all come together, do songs, written by my dad. My dad is literally still a choir master. Oh. He's been a choir master before I was born, and oh, he still he wants still to. Want, yes. Oh, that's so still amazing. Wants. I mean, I love it, I love it, I love it. When Thank I see you. siblings, family, yes. family time all together, and they have one thing they do in common. Okay, that's amazing. Now, let's talk about you as an actor. So when did you start acting? Um, officially... Um, or let me say professionally, 2016. Okay. Yes, I played a role in the movie. I was the lead um, um, character in that movie. It's a musical movie anyway. Of yes. course. Yeah. yeah, it had to do yeah. with you know, me being a little girl. I think I played like I was 14 years old okay. in the movie. And it was quite an, an amazing. And after that, I said, no, this is, I know I've always wanted to do that. You know, in school, I studied mass communication, by the way. Oh. So in school, you know, you have to do theater arts and all yeah. of that. And there are parts where you have to do the drama team. Mm -hmm. So I know that's something that has always been, you know, inside of me. Mm -hmm. But I just didn't. I never visioned it like, you know, I want to be an actor. But after 2016, I said, okay, I like this. You like I this and that's away. about it. Amazing. So yeah. since then, I mean, how did you feel, first of all? I mean, being the lead on your first. Yes. Oh, wow. Yes. Wow. That's yes. amazing. Now let's talk about Ro Roberta now. So tell me, what is Roberta about and what was your role as Um, I'm just going to spill a bit of the movie okay, so that, just you know, you can just... Just a little bit. Yes, just a little bit <laughs> so that you can... Um, Roberta is a movie about a young girl mm -hmm. who um, suffered abuse, you know, a, a young girl who is ta musically talented, mm -hmm. and then she suffered abuse from her mom, and, you know, she got vulnerable and she was tired of it, listened, you know, to her friend's advice and literally went into the street, mm -hmm. you know, left school, and I, I said, I'm going to see just a bit of the movie so that you can go watch <laughs> it. Don't watch it, it will be course, premiering on Saturday. Oh, yeah, before, just tell us a little, what, what was Sumkele? Okay, what was Sumkele? Who was Sumkele, yeah. So I was the younger version mm -hmm. oh, of okay. Sumkele, oh, and then okay. I then grew into being the Sumkele. Sumkele, okay. Now. okay. Yeah, so okay. I was the younger version, being yeah. the little girl yeah. from school, mm -hmm. and then I grew into... Sumkele herself, who got married, had kids, and all of that. Okay, so now you said in 2016, right, you actually acted as a 14-year-old. Yes. And now you're acting as a younger version. Yes, so still. Now, still, still. Uh, so, so how does that, do you think there's a stereotype in there because of how cute you are? Um, or... <laughs> so, to be honest, yeah. um, um, 
sometimes, mm -hmm. you know, it can literally get to you, you know, yeah. being on the petit side. Yeah. But I, I literally did enjoy it, you know, mm -hmm. acting as a 14 year old, being, I mean, sometimes when people still see me without makeup and all of that, they yeah, still, yeah. As you, you know, they say, oh, she's a, she's, a, she's a baby, she's a child, you know, but it, it's, it's one that I actually did enjoy, yeah. you know, acting, and it's something I, I would, you know, still in as much as I, I still want to play other roles, you know, being the big person and all of that. Mm -hmm. But acting as a fourteen year old was quite amazing. Yeah. Yes, it was. All right, amazing. I, I won't ask about your age, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, it's Valentine's Day today. Yes. What are you wearing red? It's yes. Also, we probably say you. I mean, so what's the plan? What's the plan? Um. Well. 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 After here, I'm going to go back home. Uh -huh. <laughs> And just be home. Actually. And just be home. Yes. Uh, so there's no one sending us flowers. Well, no. I'm no, sorry. not at all. Mm, guys, sorry. what are you guys waiting for? <laughs> this is a wake up, wake up. Well, no, I'm single. <laughs> oh, you're single. Yes. Amazing. So when you see yourself in the next five, ten years, yes. what do you desire? What do you hope for? Um, I've always wanted, you know, because I, I do sing, and to be honest, everything that I'm doing all together, I, I love and mm. I enjoy. Mm -hmm. So I see myself... I mean, I'm doing absolutely amazing in my um, makeup career. I've got a studio and all of that. I've got staffs and all of that, oh. right? But, you know, I see me, you know, doing even bigger things in the um, makeup, makeup industry. Music-wise, yes. I mean, I want to be out there. Music mm -hmm. is, some, most times I say music is my life. I mean, you like music, right? So I think everybody literally like likes music. Yeah. I see myself even doing, you know, bigger things in the music industry mm -hmm. and also... In acting, in acting, I mean, I see myself taking up bigger roles. Bigger roles. Yes, okay. bigger roles, you know, putting myself out there. So in five years, mm -hmm. it looks like a long time. It looks it's like a, yeah, not, it's not so long. Not long, yes. but I see me doing even bigger things that I'm bigger doing thing. right now. Amazing. It was absolutely amazing speaking with you. Thank I you. mean, I, I love the idea and the narrative that, I mean, you can be everything, yes. right? You totally can be. It will be kind of difficult to balance out, mm -hmm. but then again, we definitely... If you love it. Yeah, if you love what, what definitely you're what doing. you're doing, yeah. exactly. So I, I feel no one should just do one thing. Yes, to be honest, that's what I yes. feel. And I mean, you're doing great so far. And uh, hopefully, I'll probably visit your makeup studio. Oh soon. yes, please, please make it one. <laughs> yeah, yes, and uh, wishing you all the very Thank best you. and all the love that you need in this Thank time you. and always. about that time guys where we have to go on this amazing um, 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 Valentine edition we have Titi and Mike in the kitchen guys any final words yes yeah, so mm. final final comments no yeah final, definitely final words. Uh, oh. we're expecting the wonderful uh, the energetic and uh, Chef Mobile, he wasn't able to make it, but yeah. he will be here uh, very mm -hmm. soon next time. You know, chefs Sorry are really, really busy on Valentine's Day. You know how Definitely. many dinners they're going to be cooking today? Definitely. But he planned to be here, but, you yeah. know, just it was a little bit under the weather. Mm -hmm. But that's it. A wonderful show. Thank you for being a part of the show. Thank you mm -hmm. to everyone who's been here. Of just course. go out there. And, uh, you know, it's Ash Wednesday as yes, well as it it's Valentine. Uh, it's Ash Wednesday and the beginning of Lent and also a day to celebrate love and loved ones. All right, then show some love just because. Mm. Just because you can. There's enough red to go around from Winfrey wow. and Titi. Why do you keep removing I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye-bye. Happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Have a good one. Bye. Bye. <laughs>